everyone welcome back to my craft room if you're new to my craft room then welcome it's a really rainy ugly day out here today so I feel this is a perfect day to stay in and get caught up here I have some friend mail I want to share with you guys and also some really great finds that I got at the thrift store so first I got this lovely card from one of my subscribers named Glenda and look how cute this is I love homemade cards they're just so pretty and then she wrote me a lovely little note on the inside just to say hello and happy Halloween from Glenda. Thank you so much, Glenda. This is so cute. I love this. Oh, these are stickers on here. At first I thought this was printed on the paper. Oh, look at that. And she added some stars on here and the 31st of October sticker. Oh, that's very sweet. I'm going to go set this up out on my fireplace. That's where I always end up putting all my little cards and things that I get for a while. So thank you again, and then I was so surprised to find this package at my P.O. Box, and this is from Anne from New Jersey, and she sent me all kinds of goodies. I did find a nice, lovely little note that she wrote me, and um, you don't have to apologize for glitter, because trust me, I probably wouldn't notice. I have so much glitter everywhere in my craft room, <laughs> but thank you so much. This was so sweet of you. Thank you for your lovely letter. And let's see, she just packed this full of goodies. And she knew I was having a hard time finding this sign. So she sent me one of these. And these are so cute. These came and went at the Dollar Tree so quickly. Um, they had a bunch of other ones. But of course, the tr one with the truck. And these were on a stake, in which I usually take them off the stake anyway to use for different craft projects. So I'm going to try to find something to do with this guy, too. So thank you so much for that. And oh, things are just jumping out at me. Oh, look at these pretty stickers. Wow, these are really nice. I get 20 stickers in here. Look at these for Christmas. I love this. Look at that. I haven't seen these anywhere. That is very pretty. Oh, I can't wait to make some cards and stuff with that. Oh, and look at these snowmen. I don't have a lot of, you know, like, I have a lot of the Dollar Tree Christmas stickers and things, but nothing really cute like these. These are so cute. Thank you so much, Anne. And there's more. She sent me a whole bunch of little stickers. Oh, and these pretty little bottle stickers. These are so nice. I love these from the Dollar Tree. Oh, and then these. Oh, look at these Christmas stickers. Oh, I can't wait to use these. Thank you so much. Some more of the bottle stickers. Whoops. There's another. Wow, you've loaded me up on these pretty bottle stickers. I love these. These are so pretty. Thank you so much. And then look at these. Here we have a little reindeer and the tree. It says deck the halls. Thank you so much. And the little deer's got little googly eyes. <laughs> and here's another pack. Oh, I really appreciate these. These are going to come in very handy. Isn't that pretty? And then look at this. I couldn't believe this when I opened the package. I saw this in here. Look at all this washi tape. Oh my goodness. There is just so many. I'm not even going to count. One, two, yes I am. Three, four, five, six, seven, ten, twenty, thirty, four. I have 50 rolls of washi tape. That's incredible. Thank you so much. I love this shiny, glittery tape. Especially for the holidays now, I can use some of this. It's going to be great. Wow, thank you so much. And then she sent me these. These are really nice. Look at these glitter stickers. You got the stocking snowflakes, a package, and little snowmen. And then this has the snowflakes. These are very pretty. And then this one has the little reindeer and things. Oh, look how pretty those are in the light. Look at the little blue snowman. That's different. I like that. And then this one here with the trees and the candy canes and the little packages. Oh, these are adorable. I guess it's a Santa. It kind of looks funny in red, but that's cute. Oh, yeah, it is. You could add a little white on there, whatever you'd want. That's adorable. Thank you so much, Anne. I appreciate all this stuff so much. Because you guys know that I'm just like a crafting addict. I'm constantly doing something every day almost. And um, I 
can always use the goodies. <clears throat> so thank you both so much for my wonderful happy mail. So let me show you guys what I found. You need, every, anytime you go into your local thrift stores, you need to check out the aisle where they have all this. Usually it's just thrown in a giant bin. i got to dig through it. But I got this bag full of stuff. It was $1.19. And um, where's the opening? I thought I had it open. Well, there has to be an open. Oh, I didn't open this one. I thought I did. Sorry. Sorry for the crinkle. I got this. I like this stuff. This is really, this is like a really thin raffia, and um, this will be great for some holiday decorating and stuff. And this is the Better Homes and Gardens. It's never been opened. And then I got three packs of these pipe cleaners. This one's been opened, but this is a brand new pack here. I mean, they're very old. When they were new, they were only 89 cents. Um, not sure where they ever came from. But I got three packs of the pipe cleaners, and then I got this whole bag of wood things. I paid uh, $2.97 for this, and which is really bizarre because I was out on the hunt for these wooden blocks in this size, and I couldn't find them. Now these have like the little um, letters and things on them, like you would use, you know, like kids blocks, but they're just all nice plain wood. So these are going to be great to make some holiday decorations with. Yeah, and that's exactly the size I was looking for. But didn't even think to look at the thrift store. And then we got some of these wood buttons. I thought that was nice. This is a brand new pack. It's got nine pieces in here, the one inch buttons. And I already have a project in mind for that that I wanted to do. And that was something I didn't have. And then these are just... I guess what are these called? These are called toy wheels. And you get 12 of these little toy wheels in here. And they're all wood. And then there's some more of these buttons. Um, these are they're actually furniture buttons, they're called. And these are the three-quarter inch. So that's pretty cool. Then I got this lovely little plaque that I can do something with. Actually, there's two of them. I only thought that was one. Well, look at that. We got two of those. I mean, they're very old looking, but you know what? All you have to do is sand them down, paint them, whatever, and you can use them for whatever. Look at this cute little rake. That'll be great to put into, like, maybe a fall DIY or a Christmas one. Who knows? I don't know yet. I was just so excited to find these. Oh, here's some of these more of these little wood buttons that fell out. And then there was a whole bunch of the uh, popsicle sticks. These always come in handy for different things. So that's cool. And here's some more of the little wheels. Oh, there's another one of these little buttons. So I guess I did get the whole pack of buttons here. They just fell out. <coughs> and these are the three quarter inch little toy wheels. And here's another whole pack of the thinner popsicle sticks. And these are always good to have when you something pops in your mind you want to make. And this, I think, is actually one of those back massagers that you could run up and down someone's back or something. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. I don't really need this, but it was in the bag. <laughs> and the best thing I found of all, which I never expected to find at my thrift store, and I paid $2.97 for that, was this giant bag of pine cones. Now, if you're lucky enough to have these in your yard or woods nearby, we don't. I don't have anything that come in this. I'm trying to get this bag open nicely here. I'm not wanting to. We have the long pine cones on a tree out here, you know, that are nice to do things with too, but I love making. Oh my goodness, come on, bag. I don't want to tear you. There we go. These are the really nice, big, big pine cones. So I was so excited to find these, and actually later today I am going to start working on these for Christmas because I love making the ornaments and things out of these big pine cones. But you can find these. They have these usually at AC Moore or Michaels or anywhere. And I'm pretty sure you could probably find them at Walmart too in bags. But a lot of times they're scented. And I just like these. These are just... They may have had a little scent at one time, but... Unless it's in my head here. You know how that kind of has that cinnamony smell. Look how nice these are. 
That's a broken one, but that's all right. They're just so pretty. So I cannot wait to start making some stuff with these. So, like I said, when you go to your thrift store, you got to get in that aisle and dig through stuff because you just never know what you're going to find. And I think I got some really great deals here for less than like six dollars. I got all this stuff. Oh, and I also got a frame that I already used for something else, a really pretty wood frame. And I only paid like six dollars for everything. So that is my little video for this morning here, guys. I will see you all next time. Have a great day, everyone.